Okay guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you've been with me for a while, then you know that I'm currently like six months pregnant. Yeah, with baby number three. And here in like less than two weeks, I have to start watching my carbs. So I'm getting all of my carb cravings out of the way like in these next two weeks. Um, I had a hair over it. If you hear Jay snoring, I'm sorry. He's in this room behind me. And I can only film this when the kids are asleep. So they're asleep and I'm stuck hearing him snoring. Yippee for me. So anyways, I grabbed, like over the past week or two, I grabbed my favorites, like my favorite chips. And I am, yeah, I just had a bath and let my hair air dry so my hair's kind of crazy. Like usual, I'm in pajamas. Yes, we just had a snowstorm. Oh my gosh, I cannot even handle his snoring. It makes me want to punch somebody in the face. I hate snoring. So, these are some of my favorites. So, my favorite salt and vinegar chips are the Lay's brand. I kind of lay these out here. Uh, my favorite plain chips, it's usually like Pringles, whether it's regular or lightly salted or reduced fat, or the uh, plain Lay's in the yellow bag. Especially if you have egg salad, you have to have the plain Lay's with it. Um... My favorite tortilla chips are just the classic nacho cheese Doritos, which I don't ever buy regular size bags of them. I always buy the small because we get like a 50 pack of these bags. Um, but I also love ranch Doritos. There's nothing compares to ranch Doritos. They take me back to high school. I would eat a little bag of ranch Doritos and a string cheese like every day. My favorite sour cream and onion chips are Ruffles, which they don't ever carry at Meijer. I have to get these at Walmart, so I don't have these very often. I usually buy the Lay's, but the Ruffles are my favorite. Um, when it comes to Cheetos or cheese puffs, I always prefer the crunchy. I don't really care for cheese puffs that well. I always go for the crunchy. And as far as like spicy chips, I like the jalapeno uh, crunchers, but these are like my new jam. I just found them at the store. Like I tried a small bag the other week and I just recently found them in their full size and it's the flaming Hot Ruffles <coughs> and of course you know I love my flaming Hot Cheetos. So I will start with the least flavorful first which is the plain. No I'm not going to eat like a whole bag of each of these. So yeah, plain chips. I love a good Pringle. Mm. They're always just light and crispy. And not really greasy. I do love kettle cooked plain chips. But So good. I'm always eating the same. <clears throat> I eat one chip and two bites. That's just how I do it. Sometimes I'll eat them like in a stack. That gets kind of messy. Mm. What are your favorite plain chips? He kicked on. It's probably gonna kick it on a lot because I'm supposed to get down to negative 11 tonight, and they're all saying like turn your heat up a little bit so that your pipes don't freeze. Which I have a basement, so I don't think my pipes would freeze. I don't know. I 
I do like cheddar and sour cream chips. I do like barbecue. I, mean, I like pretty much every chip. I love dill pickle chips. These are my favorites. chips. I like plain tortilla chips, like scoops and like the yellow tortilla rounds, but nothing beats a Dorito. Doritos, like, when you first open a bag, they never taste like that ever again. Like, when you first open a bag, they have a distinct flavor and taste. And anytime you, like, reopen the bag, they just, they never taste the same. another reason why I like the small bags, but these are handier. It's like $10 at Sam's for a box of 50 of these bags. And they're always fresh. I like these by themselves. I like them dipped in sour cream. I like them on my bologna sandwich. I like them on my peanut butter sandwich. carbs. Nacho Doritos. A serving size is one ounce. Calories 140. Fat 8 grams. Carbs 16. Love Doritos. Plus, little bags of portion control so I don't sit and eat a whole big giant bag. Which I may or may have not, may or may not have done in my life. music on my old computer from like oh my god 15 years ago or longer I'm putting it on my MacBook my iTunes so many old songs I forgot about right now that song Bedrock by Little Wayne is stuck in my head
Where's the drop? Adrian had a sticker stuck on the table and I've been trying to get it off for days. Like stuck. Sticking with our Doritos, we'll just break open the ranch. I've tried like off-brand ranch Doritos. They do not even compare. Mm -hmm. Just like a pregnant person's dream right here. At least for me, I'm a chip person. Like occasionally I want sweets, but I'm all about the crunch and the carbs. And the salty. <laughs> it tastes so good. It's so funny. <clears throat> I don't know if funny is a word, but I do eating videos. I do what I eat in a day. <clears throat> sometimes it's healthy stuff, sometimes it's not. And when it's not, boy, do I hear about it. But it's like there are people that I watch. That have way more subscribers and way more views than I do, who eat a ton more than I do and way worse than I do, and they do eating shows with their kids, like every single video has their kids in it eating worse food than we eat. And you don't see any comments. Maybe they have it set up that they have to approve them and they just don't approve us. I don't know. But for as small as my channel is, and as little views as I get, I should get a lot of hatred about what I eat. If I want to eat healthy, I'll eat healthy. If I want to eat crap, I'll eat crap. I'm 40 years old, six months pregnant with baby number three. I'm going to enjoy my pregnancy and eat whatever I crave. I don't care. So people think I eat so horrible. I mean, I'm six months pregnant and I've only gained 13 pounds. I mean, I have two and a half months to go before I have the baby. With both of my girls, I gained roughly 30 pounds. That's the average that they say that you gain during pregnancy. I'm not even halfway there and I have two and a half months left, so I'm obviously doing not, that, not doing that bad. So if a pregnant lady wants to eat some junk, let her. I 
if a pregnant lady wants to be moody, let her. These are so good. Digging. button keeps catching on the edge of the table. <clears throat> I do not like the Pringles salt and vinegar. I do like the cake cod. Yeah, the cake cod salt and vinegar they're like the uh, kettle cooked and they like tear up my mouth between the hardness and then the salt. So these My sister and I were in college. In the morning, we would get a bag of these and a bag of the pretzel nuggets and eat them together. Like one, a pretzel and one of these in your mouth at the same time it is the best flavor. Like, why has nobody ever made salt and vinegar pretzels? So good together. College days. Speaking of pretzels, my favorite pretzels are the roll gold um, tiny twist, the honey mustard, and they quit making them for whatever reason. So I don't have a favorite because I can't find any other honey mustard pretzels. They have, what is it? Honey Dijon pretzel crisps. I haven't tried them. I always love any kind of pretzel, but they're really good dipped in ranch too, but the honey mustard tiny twists were so good. I did find honey mustard little pretzels, but they're gluten free. I haven't tried them yet. I haven't. Salt and vinegar chips, I can't eat too many of them because they just burn my mouth. off for like five minutes and it kicks back on.
big snowstorm yesterday. We got like 10 inches of snow, I think. negative 4 and we have a wind chill advisory until Monday 12 p.m. So wind chill advisory is until tomorrow because this is Sunday night. Tomorrow at noon. So very cold wind chills expected. Wind chills as low as 15 below to 25 below zero. It's going to be negative 14. Holy crap. Okay. Well, Tuesday's going to warm up and the low is going to be 35. And Wednesday it's going to be high of 42 and rain. Wednesday a high of nine. What's today's high? Oh, six. Cool. Okay. Next up we will go with Yes, the ruffle sound cream and onion are the best. I like the Lay's, I like the Pringles, but Ruffles is where it's at. Mm -hmm. Number one, they're crispier. Number two, they're thicker. Number three, they have a much stronger flavor. Like a stronger onion flavor. I do like the sour cream and onion stacks too. chips and sour cream and onion are like the only ones I ever put on my sandwiches. I want to try a flaming hot ruffles on a sandwich. Cheetos and flaming hot Cheetos I like to put in my spaghetti.
<clears throat> I made spaghetti tonight and didn't put anything in them. Now, when I make taco salad, I usually use either regular Doritos or recently I started using the spicy nacho Doritos, and it's amazing. Are you a cookie person or a chip person? <clears throat> like a candy person? Adri and Jay, they are like a chocolate person. They can sit and eat chocolate like all day long. Like Hershey Kisses, Reese Cups. Whatever. <clears throat> Me, like when I eat candy, I like either like sour stuff. Like Sour Patch Kids. Or the Sour Ropes. Rainbow belts, that type of stuff. I mean, don't get me wrong, every now and then I like a good Reese cup or like Snickers bar. But. Run constantly all night. I don't want my pipes to freeze either. <clears throat> I have one sixty nine. It's like I don't want it super hot upstairs either, where it's hot and stuffy, because then we can't sleep good. See what it is in, in Alex's room. In my room, I have the heater vent shut, so it's always cold in there. because it has five windows. Mm. Stuff that's 68 in the living room, but that, that's on the outside wall. I guess I'll leave it at 69. Open that vent more. Then it'll be warmer in here faster. Right? And then maybe the heat won't keep on constantly. Okay. Good old basic cheetah. She does, I think about mm -mm. back in the day. You see, like, all the gossip magazines, or the like, star, 
there's like a bunch of them. Not the Inquire, but like the other ones. What the heck were they called? I don't know, they always had celebrities and stuff in them. And Britney Spears was always in them. And she was always eating like the Cheetos Puffs. Or Paul's. Or this or that, but they were never the crunchy. Like, what is wrong with her? Crunchy is where it's at. Bit my cheek. So good. I love chips. How many I try so far? I don't know. Very low. crunch. I'm actually hungry. We had dinner around 6.30. <clears throat> I had spaghetti, green beans, and only one piece of Texas toast. I usually have two pieces of Texas toast, if not more. And right now it's 12.35 a.m. So I haven't eaten in six hours. I'm going cleaning, picking up toys. I took a bath, doing laundry. Tired though. chips, like some kind of chip every single day. <clears throat> Pretty sure. Maybe not every day, but growing up, that was like a go-to lunch, just a sandwich with chips on the side. Or at dinner, we had pizza with Doritos on the side. Or we'd have egg salad with the plain lays on the side, or grilled cheese with chips on the side. Like, that was just... We had... spaghetti so I need to remember to get out my Cheetos when I eat it. Not today. I 
saw years ago, like a trick to eating <clears throat> Cheetos or cheese puffs, either use a toothpick or a fork to pick them up so you don't get cheesy fingers. But, It's crazy. It's expensive electric bill. Well. <clears throat> I guess there's only one day, but I don't want my furnace to die either. They was tonight and Adri's already asleep. see it really well I might wake her up. <clears throat> anyway, I've just eaten chips and rambled on for 40 minutes. These, I've tried these once and I loved them dip in sour cream and I usually dip those in sour cream or like ranch. Um, <clears throat> sour cream. <clears throat> this ice chewing is a pregnancy thing. At the end of my pregnancy with Adri, I ate ice like crazy. And at the end of my pregnancy with Alex, I ate ice like crazy. And now like within the last week or two, I've been eating ice like crazy. And when I'm not pregnant, the thought of I chewing ice, if someone does it, about makes me ugh. And yes, chewing ice and eating ice is a sign of anemia, but it's also a very popular and common uh, pregnancy craving. The last few nights I've laid in bed, like the last three or four nights I've laid in bed with a cup of ice, just laying in my bed eating ice. So weird. <clears throat> so weird. But yeah. If you like these types of videos, uh, comment down below what are your favorite chips. You don't have to tell me like your favorite sour cream or your favorite salt and vinegar, but if you want to, you can. Just like what's your favorite chip. And thank you so much for watching, as always. I've gained quite a few uh, new subscribers lately, so welcome. Thank you for subscribing. And yeah. To do another ASMR of eating ice. My last one was when I was pregnant for Alex, and she's about to be two, so it's been a while. So, yeah, I'll see you in my next video.